least everyone got a job level up. Let's, uh... He's fainted. He can stay a thief now. There's the mandolin of the might. Noah's lute, the mythical instrument lost to the flow of time, began to play a tender tune. I can't really see them. They're blocked off by the desk. They look like high heel shoes. I was listening to a loot solo. Obtain Noah's loot. Noah's my favorite uh, VeggieTales character. Like that movie where they're like, Noah's a prophet. He never really bought it. He wrapped in his face. Rock, rock. <laughs> Stomp. Okay, what's the difference between Stonk, Stomp and Clobber? Because I thought Clobber was the single target. And Stomp was the group hit. The Diamond Shield. Well, no one uses shields. Let's get the fudge out! Alright, let's go to... I forgot the name of it. Big Town. Let's go to Big Town. Ah, oh, well, back to Big Town. They didn't have it in here. But they have the resurrection thing here. Okay, no. No, 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 no. Move, move, move. Thank you. Then let's do some job changing. You go back to being a black mage. Optimize your gear. You go to being a black belt. Optimize your gear. The Invoker experiment. Invoker. Evokers, not Invoker. Evoker is fun. Could be better. By could be better, I mean, dear God. There's gotta be some way to flip the odds to be one way or the other, not just always a coin flip. I'm assuming Summoner does it better. But we won't know. At least I don't know yet. Let's, this is the cave where she was taking a nap. We're gonna go on a spirit journey like the end of Earthbound. Pull out Noah's loot. The sonorous strumming of the lute reverberated around the room and passed into the world of dreams. Things that bother me never bother me, I feel happy and fine. Living in the sunshine, living in the sunshine, having a wonderful time. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> oh, she turned into an old lady wearing a potted plant on her head. Ah! Squawk! Who knows awake? Who knows awake? Squawk! It was a nice nap. Come here and sit on your shoulder. On my shoulder, sweetie bird. Yes, ma'am, squawk. 
I'm still a bit stiff from such a long sleep. Gotta shake off the cobwebs. And she dances around. Aha! The name's an A overseer of the world of dreams at your service. I've been asleep for so long, I hardly know what to make of the world nowadays. So oh, by the real world's impressive, don't you think? But enough about that. Doga managed to reach me in my sleep and told me about you and what Zand had done. First things first, we need a ship strong enough to transport us up and over the mountain ranges. We should find what we're looking for in the ancient ruins to the north. Well, what are we looking for? Let's be off. You're coming? What? Are you embarrassed to go on an adventure with a venerable old mage like me? No, no, that's not what I... I thought so. Well then, shall we? Une has joined the party. Oh my dear, I almost forgot here. Hey, there's the third fang. What's this? So what the elemental fangs you've been collecting with this, you should have three in total. With all four fangs, you hope to get past the statues and guarding his tower. In order to find the final fang, you'll need a formidable ship. Don't doubt him. So that's all that's really left. I need to get the big airship, which will let me fly over mountains. And once I get the big banana that lets me fly over mountains, I could go to... Like, I could go to Dick Lake. What? Yeah, there's a lake in a dick-shaped section on the map. Come look, see? Right there. Dick Lake. I can figure out the mystery of Dick Lake. Alright, so you're gonna show up in here. Fight a zombie dragon, apparently. Uh, does the old does the old magic rule work? This is gonna fucking wreck his day. We got some good old fashioned fire. Like the good old days. Hey, look at that, Kier did. Wreck his booty. The blood sword is bad, though. You get to guard. You get to cure yourself. I know. You're above half. Some guard. No, and two, I never used the cure to damage undead because fire was so effective against them. Didn't have to worry about it. <sighs> Researching ancient ruins, yes. Let me handle this rock. If I demolish an obstacle in the dream world, it'll get rid of the one in the real world, too. Not even Adamantite stands a chance against me. Now stand back! just falls asleep and then it explodes. Phew, these old bones aren't what they used to be. It took a lot out of me. The invincible's further on. Okay, let's say, please don't tell me I need thief tools. These bitches. Hit him with the big thunder. Oh, they divide every time I hit them. I thought it was an ability, like, I thought it was an attack ability they had. I have to kill them in one foul swoop or they divide. Yes! Get out of here. Reflective mail. It gives me a boost to magic defense. But less defense and more evasion. So, uh, you know, I'll go with reflective mail. As long as it doesn't reflect healing magic. Like Mirror Mail does in the Tactics games, we should be fine. 
Well, if I want to get out of here. Well, the image on her side. Oh, no, no. Azazels were assholes, because if I hit them and they didn't die, they would divide in half. He should be... Oh, no, he's not wearing a black robe, because there's the... I see. Speaking of which, uh... Old buddy, old pal, as you're liking. The, uh... The big bad of this game is Zand, who's working with darkness to plunge the world in darkness. Just like a post-game A Realm Reborn. Yeah, it's the almighty darkness. Which is a big puff cloud lady. We don't need a blood sword. Buying a second defender would be cool though. <laughs> Who speaks in third person? Urk. Yes. Scrupulous merchants keep breaking the ancient ruins and stealing artifacts to sell. Yep, 200 gil. We'll take a nap. No, the entire... And I've been blown... Uh, and late mid-game of this game. Or as we... Yes. Uh, uh, they... I just started Shadowbringers, as you know. I, I, I've told this story a lot already. Uh, but as you well know, I started Shadowbringers. So I've been hearing about Paralysis here. And, uh, this entire dungeon, like the entire mid-late game of this has been, oh, light has overwhelmed the world and destroying everything, and there needs to be a balance of darkness. And it's up to the warrior of darkness to stop all this light long ago, and I'm like, this is just Shadowbringers again. <laughs> I'm playing this twice now. Where's my boy Alphana? Needs more Emmet. Yeah, no, I'm not fighting you guys. Like, if I had a large chocobo spot, I would switch him to be a thief so he could cast Scram. What are you saying ew about? <laughs> Why'd you say it like that one character from Smiling Friends? The one that's like, get out of my head, man! Get out of my head! Oh, he's already wearing a black belt gi. Damn it. No, wait. Magic. Here. On him. Thank you. Hmm. If we get lucky, we might be able to kill him in one foul swoop. Nope. into any locked doors, I'll be happy. A chakra band. Do you already have a chakra band equipped? Of course you already have a chakra band equipped. No. A no.
there were end game enemies in Final Fantasy 2 that I called fuck you enemies. Because they were. They had instant death kills, they had high damage. And they were the. Like, in the last two or three dungeons, all the fights were fair, balanced fights. You know, they take me two turns of combat, and the enemies would get good hits in. Except for those enemies. They would come in, and they would just rip me in half every time. Ooh, fairy claws. <laughs> and I guess the, uh... Azazel is kind of the equivalent of that. They're just mean enough to make me go, mm, nah, don't want it. Don't even want to do that. Cool, JD and JD leveled up. Basement 3. Get the fuck out. I don't care. Bite my ass. We're leaving. Say that again. and eat her. I'm an eater. What do you eat? Yeah. Oh, they also divide. Wait, why don't I? We're gonna flee this fight. And then we're gonna change JD. Where hopefully we can take these fights. This is the this is the dungeon. Uh whenever I looked up jobs, they were like, the Dark Knight sucks. Except in one dungeon. Uh-oh. No, apparently we're not going to use the Dark Knight. We'll just wing it. We'll do it live. I'm not above running from every fight. No, no, no. You guys cheat, so we're leaving. Had to zoom in to see what you were doing. Like, if I get another faint before I reach the bottom of this dungeon, or if I get overly frustrated, I'll just go someplace where I can buy heavy armor. And katanas for Dark Knights. No, I've already killed one. I don't need to kill him. I already got it for the decks. Ah, here we are, the Invincible. Okay, cool. The smell of Chocobo. So I have a free Chocobo whenever I want. I have a free rest bed whenever I want.
Are these shops? Kiraja. Isuna. Reflect. Quake. Drain. Breaka. Ashura. Interesting. Okay, so we have all the good armor, basically, already. You need those spells, though. Time to set sail. You take the helm. This is your ship now. Oh, buy PlayStation 4. I'll give you a guided tour of the ship. Use the ladder if you want to disembark. When you want to come back aboard, stand directly below the ship. Press confirm. Press confirm to redline the engines so the ship can clear small mountains when you fly, fly back them. Heave to a halt by pressing the confirm button over land. You can steer from the helm. Are we clear? All right, follow me. I already took this tour. This is a vending corner. I also use my magic so that Fat Chocobo can be summoned to the cubby behind me. Come on out, big fella. Fat Chocobo appeared. There he is in all his fat glory. You can rest up in that bed over there. Now, if you excuse me, I must go to Doga. You're leaving already? That's right. I trust you can handle what lies ahead. What matters now is you obtain the Fang of Earth that rests in the Cave of Shadows north of Amur. Once you have it, return to Doga's matter. There's something we still need to give you. It's up to you now. We'll meet again at Doga, I'm sure. The old lady who could have hung out at en on my boat leaves. Can I use the cannons? I guess not. Oh, I now have my own super... Oh, shit. Get big. supposed to be able to go over mountains by A disembarks okay what that's the map button okay here we go hmm I misunderstand her the confirm button, which would be A. Oh, I can just disembark wherever I want now? Okay, that's not important. And I go up? Okay, cool. Is there only specific mountains I can go over? <laughs> ah, I can only go over one space of mountain. How fascinating. That looks like a face gone. Ah. That's not enough space. I'm glad I received this super duper big ass airship. So I can barely flutter over things. The artillery is pro Oh shit! Aw oh, fuck! The cannons do work! Alright. This is the best Final Fantasy game. Like. Top of the list already. 
Give me an airship with working cannons. What, what, what? What, what do you got, Final Fantasy 1? You got, um, compelling, like, entry into series? What you got, Final Fantasy 2? A complex story with named characters? Well, I got an airship with cannons now, so fuck you. Me meow indeed, Kiwi. A gargoyle? I like that we are ambushed, we can still fucking fire into the heavens at them. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh. There's some sort of lady ninja in there, so we'll call that. I don't remember Mimosa Dragon, but they're playing Fortnite, and they look they look like a cool group, so we'll check them out for a bit. Uh, tomorrow. I might beat this game. I'm playing it pretty quickly from what I can tell. But who knows? I'll do some research after this. Love ya.